Hey what's up guys, it is Saiku or Sam here and welcome back to the channel guys and today I'm bringing you guys the second episode of Firewatch playthrough. I hope you guys are going to enjoy this video and if you do make sure to leave a like down below and also hit the subscribe button if you want to stay up to date for new cool content like this one. And in the previous episode we basically got started with the game. And if you're not familiar with this series, I'm going to link episode 1 in the description down below where I also talk a little bit about the series, why I'm actually doing this. And if you want to learn, learn about it right now, it's basically because we're going to analyze these games that we're playing and they're going to mostly be the indie games that are released by either Unity or UE4. And if you have your own games you would like me to play like Firewatch, let me know in the comments and send me a mail at viewers at the mail address will be in the mail uh, description down below as well, so just shoot me a mail and I will play the game. And now our option or, or like the our quest kind of is to find a rope in NFS cage box uh, 306. And I learned how to look through the map. So here we are in the red circle. Um, and then cache 306 is right there. So we just have to follow this path kind of. Uh, nothing more than that. I guess we're in the right way because the tower is there and that's the rectangle in the map. There we go. So we just follow this path and we'll see if we go right there. So, oh, I want to hide. There we go. Okay. Um, I'm actually shooting this video before I like upload the episode one. <laughs> So I don't really know yet what you guys feel about these videos or this series that I started, but if you like them, let me know in the comments. It's very important for me to keep this communication with you guys. Um, let's look at the map one more time. I just want to make sure that we're on the right way. Okay, so we're actually pretty close to it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Convenient. All right. All right, all right, all right. There we go. Uh, supply cage. Okay, I found a supply box, so there are a lot of these out in the woods. What's the code again? I remember the code, it's one, two, three, four. It's for every single one, but I wanna ask, um, I just say I, I found, found the supply, supply box. box. Great. <laughs> wow, that was it. Okay. Um, oh, how do we, oh, I see, three, Two, one, and oh no, I'm at two. Okay, four. Nice. I like the falling animation of the lock, old rope. Oh no, I forgot to. God damn it, I forgot to um note it. I thought we weren't supposed to leave food out. Hey, there's a snack in here. Probably gonna eat it. You definitely do not want to do that. Whatever's in there has been in there for years. That's how you get food poisoning. Oh well, wow. let's drop it then. Mm. Pine cone. Interesting. What is the hair on the arm? <laughs> I like that. I like that detail. Mm. All right, let's just go with the flow right now. Um, I don't know where. Deal with whoever is setting up fireworks. Okay. Where were the guys that are setting the fireworks? I hear it from there. I'm not sure. I think it was... R oh, oh, wow. This is convenient. Why did you... Oh my gosh. I I wish the game told me that we could run or sprint earlier. So we're just going in the west. Dude, the scenery right now, man. Oh my god. Look at this beauty. Like, it just looks so simple that it's way too beautiful. Can I jump over this? Oh my gosh, you can. I didn't mean to do that, though. <laughs> okay, so I guess we're on the right way now. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it was west. Rope hook. Uh, uh, this shale slide is steep. How do you expect holy. me to get down this? I don't remember it being that bad. It's not even named on our topos. It should be called Cripple Gulch, just east of gonna pee in a bag forever flats. <laughs> oh, is that Absorka Indian? Maybe, maybe Creek? Uh, it's actually English for not in my job description. <laughs> okay. Dude, this looks scary. I wanna hike sometime. 
What is like? Am I am I brave enough? Probably not. Dude, I love those rocks. Oh dude. Oh. Oh. Well that was the inconvenient. Okay. <laughs> hey. What the hell's wrong with you? Uh, Cripple Gulch got me. <laughs> what exactly happened? My rope snapped coming down the shale slide. Think you'll have to pee in a bag for the rest of your life? No, I think I'll make it. Well, be careful for Christ's sake. Mm. Wow. It is a hell of a nice camping spot down here by the lake. I haven't been down there in years, but yeah, Jonesy Lake area is perfect. This looks gorgeous. Mm. Uh oh. Finding a bunch of empty beer cans. They threw them all over hell. The idiots down at the lake? Yeah, them. I just found where they're hanging out. Probably. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not the maid. <laughs> Wait, can I actually pick these up and like throw them somewhere? Is there like a trash can or something? I don't know. Wait, we can clean up? Really? I I don't want to do that. <laughs> I'm not that kind, okay? That takes way too much time. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Backpacks. Oh. They left their packs tied up here. Don't fuck with them. The last thing we need is some hikers filing a report about harassment. Wow. I was actually thinking we could actually pick them up. Oh, look. They decided to have a campfire, too. You know, they color coded the fire danger wow. signs in case people were illiterate. But I guess that doesn't take into account just plain stupid, does it? Well, they left their clothes out to dry. It looks like uh, two people. Well, uh, what if they're naked? Won't that be exciting? Look, they're obviously still there, so tell them off and then head back. Okay. <laughs> Fine by me, lady. Oh. Now we're getting. I found a bra. A nudie pyromaniac. Remain professional. Uh, there are. Uh... Seriously? I don't want to say that word again. There's a... Ooh. Yes? There are two naked ladies out here. Can you handle that? Come on. Uh-oh. Like naked ladies, same as anyone, but there's... You know, I found them in the lake. Skinny dipping? Yeah. Is that a guy over there? Oh, boy. <laughs> Enjoy dealing with that. How do I talk to them? Oh. Uh, let's be. Let's be kind of nice with it. You gotta take it easy with the fireworks, all right? You ought to take it easy with the sizzler buffet. Hey, Chelsea, what? There's some loser out in the woods. Exploding. Why do guys think it's all right to just stare at girls? Wow. So you're going to be a bitch, okay? <laughs> what? Gross. No, I was. I didn't. What the hell were you looking for? Panties? No, no. Ew. Can we just get out of here? Ew. Totally. You're gross. You're just wow. a bad man out in the woods. <gasps> I can pick up the boombox. I remember that now. Oh. No, they actually went. I wanted to tell them that I picked their boombox up. Wait, where do we go? Hey, Find a way go back okay. to... Uh... I hope it's not. Oh, wow. <laughs> um, the music's uh, a little loud. Ooh, oh, she realizes sorry. that. I took her stereo. Okay, well, uh, I guess we're all even then? Yeah, I think so. But seriously, though, <gasps> thanks for no. dealing with it. So there's no uh, noise ordinances or rules out here. Uh, I don't know if this is the right way. Music I hear makes a good case for him. Yeah, no kidding. The fact that you can take the boombox is amazing.
<laughs> this is kind of cool. So every time it was like a different one. Okay, so where do we go? It needs keys. <laughs> Why do I throw it every time? Okay. I guess we'll just climb over here. Is it wrong? Or is it weird that I never get tired of this song? No joke, I had it in my music playlist for a while. Oh. Whoa. There's some guy out here. Some guy? Wait, he's looking at you? Is he doing anything else? I I don't think so. Hmm. He just went. Henry, there's there's something I something someone should have told you about this area. What is it? It's outside. Come on. The whole thing. And people come and go as they please. It's 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 madness. Yeah, yeah, okay. I get it. Bumping into someone in the middle of nowhere is part of the fun. That's what you call fun. <laughs> okay then. Uh, that was kind of creepy though. Mm -mm. Cool. <laughs> Convenient. Okay. I like. I like the realism of like climbing and all that, and hiking. Like they don't want to hurry it up and just like put you down in the in one, at once. They want you to take your time to actually climb. It's kind of it's kind of fun. It's not challenging, but it's more fun. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> that fall though. Uh, well, that trail isn't closed anymore. Oh really? Yeah, I took care of the block path. Um, it was backbreaking, but you know, anything for the service. Well, thank you. Anytime. <laughs> I remember this. <laughs> huh. you know, I don't think there's any fictional character I hate more than Forrest Burns. Henry, as an employee of the Forest Service, that is treason. That was really freaked me out as a kid. He inspired me to spend the bulk of my 30s keeping. So this generator, it's all the power I've got out here. Yep, it doesn't go through much gas, and, well, you don't have much in the way of electronics, so... What about my hairdryer? Oh, I'm sorry. You <laughs> might just have to make peace with frizzy locks. I could oh. never. Uh... What can I do for you? Well, my typewriter is on the ground. Wait, the music is changing. Power. You right? Yeah, look, uh, the wind? Ooh. No, how the hell... You should get inside. Fuck me. I like how the music changed from out of nowhere. Like the ambience and all that. Wow, this is so cool. Oh! Someone broke in. They what? They just, they wrecked the place. Threw my typewriter out the window. Motherfucker! Holy shit! Um, I'll let the Forest Service know what happened. What? I'm gonna have to fix the window. Tomorrow, Henry, you won't be cold. Uh, where do I place this? Okay. <laughs> that was convenient. <laughs> like, literally throws it. Okay, I put in a call. That was fast. Thanks. Okay, thanks. Do you have any idea who would have done this? I guess that guy. Oh. This could actually be true. The girls at the lake, maybe the guy in the canyon. Maybe that guy I saw in the canyon, but I don't know why the fuck he'd want to mess with my stuff. Well, I'll have the rangers keep an eye out for a man hiking on his own and question him if they find him. <sighs> I can't believe someone would do this. I worry about bears and fires, and that's about it. And now I've got to worry about some deranged hiker going after lookouts? Great. Uh, okay, in the morning I'm going to call my friend Patty, who works the desk down in Cody. They keep a list of everyone who's officially been in and out of the trailhead since, I don't know, forever, and see if we can get a list of names. We won't get much, but at least if anything else happens, we can refer to it and see if anything comes up. Thanks. I need you to feel safe out here. I don't really feel so safe. <laughs> Just, Just point me to the Forest Service weapons cache and I'll feel safer than the Pope in his little car. Yeah. Uh, 
Uh, someone made the choice years ago that leaving people with infinite amounts of alone time and a gun was kind of a bad idea. Grenades? I'll see what I can do. <laughs> okay. Alright. So that's pretty much it for day one, I guess. Um, let's see where it loads. Then we're probably going to end this episode here because it's kind of long as well. We that cup up. was that cup was empty. Uh. Hey, wake up. Yeah, I. I'm sorry. I'm awake. I'm awake. What's your problem? Our problem. Sorry, our problem. That storm knocked out the phone line I used to talk to the service, which means we're cut off. I tried radioing out, and that's not working either. Uh, there's no backup. I really Can I go fix it? I don't want to throw this there's at no myself. Backup? The backup is the two-day hike out of here. So that's a no. It's easier for me to send all the lookouts out to check the status of the wire in their areas. Yours is a good hike away. If you find any portion of it down, I can try to get a hold of a ranger, and he'll bring someone in to fix it. Okay, I can do that. Where is it? Remember that cave you hiked through yesterday? Yeah, of course. So, you're gonna wanna go back there, go through it, and keep going straight to the north when you come out. Will do. Thanks, Hank. Wow. It's Henry. What, you don't like Hank? Yeah, I don't like Hank. But thanks rhymes with Hank. No, it doesn't. Okay, alright. <laughs> I swear the dialogue is just incredible. Okay, guys. So we're going to be ending this episode here as well. Thank you so much for watching this episode. I hope you're enjoying you're enjoying your time watching this playthrough series. It's once again my first time, kind of my first time making playthrough gameplay or gameplay videos. So let me know in the comments what you think of this and let me know in the comments if you have any feedback for me to get better at this. Because I don't only want to, you know, analyze the game and all that, which is the main point of the series. I still want to make, you know, cool, fun content for you guys to actually watch and enjoy. So if you have any feedback, Hit me up in the comments anytime, I'm always responsive, which is a lie, <laughs> but I will try to reply as much as I can. And with that being said, also leave a like if you enjoyed the video and if you would, if you would like to show some support and also hit the subscribe button if you want to stay up to tune for new cool content like this one coming up soon. I have some more Firewatch gameplay and I will also link episode 1 in the description if you haven't watched it. But other than that, there will be a lot of the, you know, speed level designs, gameplay videos, etc. coming up. So um, just subscribe if you want to stay up to tune. And with that being said, once again, thank you so much for watching. And I will catch you in the comments. See you guys. Peace out. Bye-bye.